<laughs> hey, I'm Angie. And I'm Ryan. And we're Happy Healthy Vegan. Vegan. Oh my goodness, we are so swagged out today. Yeah, and our brand new Muscle <laughs> Tees Happy Healthy Vegan old school logo. Nice. Got more of these in stock as well. All stocked up shop at happyhealthyvegan.org. But uh, we're not here to talk about that today. We're here to talk about Vegan Cut Snack Box. Woo! And the timing couldn't be better because we are actually, uh, we've been working. We've been I doing know. a big photo shoot yep. and we are quite ready to snack. I know. It looks pretty spectacular. You know, actually, I get a split box. So inside of my snack box is also a beauty box. <laughs> Maybe I'll open it for you really quickly at the end. But uh, we're here to snack. Yeah. We are. And, uh, I am. I know. Let's see. This is. Oh, yeah. Was, oh, I've got the wrong job. card. That's the, beauty, the beauty box card? card. All right, cool. No biggie. Here's I the card right here. Oh, awesome. No, this is a lollipop. Oh, no. <laughs> I, I bet you anything. I put the card in here. Wow. We're really not on top of it today. Here we go. So this May snack box supports Angel and Friends at Iowa Farm Sanctuary. Aww. And the theme for this month's snack box is Clever Classics. Innovative takes on old favorites. I can't wait because hmm, we like should be interesting. classic old stuff. Uh, well, we're classic old stuff. We are, are from we the not? 60s, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're just going to start anywhere. All right, so. grab. <gasps> Cookies! Cookies. Ooh, cookie I'm, plus protein? I'm ready to try, try a cookie. I know, right? Whose who's cookie is this? Bake City USA. Ah, a okay. A soft-baked chocolate chip Ooh. cookie full of plant-powered energy. Hmm, that sounds good. I was saying everything in this box yeah. is vegan. That's why <laughs> Vegan Cuts is their name. Vegan Cuts. Snack box. Ooh, Ooh, that cookie looks amazing. It's a fat cookie. That looks so good. Smell it. Mmm, wow, that smells good. Oh, cool. Wow, nice fat chocolate chips yeah, in there. Yeah, it looks amazing. Mmm, soft. They said it was a soft cookie. Mm. Wow. Mmm, yeah. that's good. It doesn't have any kind of proteiny mm -mm. taste. Does that work proteiny? Oh, I feel like we could go to town on that. Woo, that's no, pretty good. We could good. go to town. It is a weekend no, night for us, sort of, here, so we could party. What's that? Is those pig out chips from Outstanding? They won. They oh. won last year at the uh, Natural Products Expo West for like best. Yeah, uh, chip I remember snack. we had the CEO or something was. From... I think he worked with Beyond Meat or That's something in the early I days. Too. And he made a startup here. Yeah. And we discovered him approximately a year ago, and I haven't seen what mm -hmm. they've been doing since. But I see they have new flavors. Yeah. Like a bacon chip or something that they made last year. That's right. It was a bacon chip. <laughs> but this is supposed to be a pigless pork rind, which believe me, wow. I. Wow. I know. I've never really had a pork rind before. No, just a really flavorful chip here. I mean, like I said, I've never had a pork rind, but pork rinds always looked really greasy. And this almost reminds me more of the way, like, I don't know, like a, like a cheese puff kind of. Yeah. It's just really it's some nice kind of, flavor. it's like a vegan chip with a great barbecue flavor. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Mm. Yeah, these cool. guys continue to impress. I'm remembering more about them now. I remember their... Pico's bacon chip was made out of mushroom, crafted by renowned chef Dave Anderson. Huh. Wholesome ingredients. Okay, so I guess there's not just a mushroom-based yeah. company. And they're from Los Angeles. Let's see. This is a Zollipop. Helpful lollipops that taste great and are good for your smile. This is clean teeth candy. Well, that's the whole thing about vegan cuts. They they try to source and they do source foods that you might you know think that are not the healthiest in the world, but yeah. these products, these companies make healthier than what you remember products bro look at this looks this claim it says they naturally raise the ph after a meal and help reduce reduce the risk of tooth decay wow i don't think your grandfather's jelly pops are doing yeah. that right so i guess we would eat this after we snacked in everything <laughs> yeah let's do that after this because it looks like they have them everywhere walmart whole foods target wow kroger walgreens fred meyer so ah these guys the soulful project uh oatmeal i we had had them in a vegan cuts box before and then we met them at natural products Ex expo west well you have a good memory yeah i remember they had this really cool display and they were showing like Every time we took a sample, they also donated wow. uh, oats to different cities, and they were trying to fill in the whole map of the United States. It was a very catchy PR uh, campaign. So, Soulful Project Hearty Grains and Seeds Cereal, perfectly yeah. paired with Julie's Dates for Overnight Oats. Oh. All right, so we just quickly made the Soulful Project Oats, and uh, I was so tempted to put in fresh blueberries, babe. 
Yeah. <laughs> it's hard not yeah. to, huh? but I we want to try it on its own. Yeah, here. I know this is a this is a plain. The, some of the ones I've tried before had like little dried blueberries and stuff in it. This is just a straight up hmm. plain like oatmeal with flax seed, as you can see, and some other little things. All right. It smells good. Hmm. Yeah, nice oatmeal. It tastes like super healthy. It's, it's just it doesn't seem sweetened at all. It just seems like very healthy, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, I don't detect any sweet. I have another bite here because mm -hmm. I, I would I would sweet. put some like agave or something. Yeah, and I think the blueberries would help it a lot. But mm -hmm. there's other flavors. This is just I think just the standard base. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. And I noticed, too, on the package when I was making it, that they do still donate for each oh. serving that a person buys. They donate to a food bank. That's really cool, especially yeah. right now. I know, exactly. So that's cool. Got to applaud a company that does something like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know we've had these a million times. These seem to come in a lot of the uh, bags that we get from, like, VegFest and stuff like that. Go Macro, the Macro Bar, High Protein. Oh, they have a new flavor, though. No, it okay. says Double Chocolate <gasps> plus Peanut Butter Chips Macro Bar. These Ooh. peanut butter chips are giving us life. Oh, wow. Smooth Sanctuary. Okay, so we've had Go Macro, and I remember we liked them, but the new flavor, I'm excited. All right, cool. So that's what's fun about these boxes. We find new products from new companies or new yeah. products from companies we know yeah. about. So this, this is fun. Look at how delicious that looks. All the peanut butter chunks in it. Mmm, mm, that's pretty good. You know, it tastes like a brownie. Yeah. A brownie with peanut butter. Mmm. It's very oh, good with yeah. the chocolate brownie it's vibe. It's pretty delicious. Mm -hmm. Let's keep going. Moving on. Mm. All right. Mm. Oh, hey. Speaking of VIP bag swag. Yeah, we've had this before. Unisoy. Suna soy jerky. Oh, the yeah. The original vegan jerky in a teriyaki flavor. Oh, okay. This is they have either black pepper, teriyaki, or spicy. So maybe you'll get a different flavor. Let us yeah. know if you did. Yeah. Um, packed with jerky and or packed with flavor. I like packed. <laughs> our jerky's packed with jerky. <laughs> <laughs> and enjoyably chewy. That means it's gonna be fun to yeah. chew. I uh, usually let you have most of the unisoy because you've always been a jerky fan, and we've tried a lot of different vegan jerkies. Yeah. I mean, I, I rarely go out and get you know buy vegan jerky, but yeah, yeah. what I do. I, I got you some I for appreciate. Christmas a couple years ago. I remember that. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> no, it's not too tough on the teeth. Some are harder than others, mm -hmm. as you guys know. Yeah. This is, I would label this more slightly on the moist side. Just a little moist. Mm. Mm. Not overly. It's a little bit sweet, huh? Mm. Like a little bit of a citrus yeah. flavor. This is a great flavor. Mm. I am impressed, Unisoy. Call me. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Daddy, you need I'm some free work, jerky. I'm going to work together with you guys. <laughs> mm. That's good. That would be cool to get a, a vegan jerky sponsor. Yeah, that's what you need. It's like my dream. That is. That's the dream. <laughs> yeah. Jerky for Ryan. <laughs> I have a feeling this is something I have to prepare, you guys. Oh, no. Ripe rice made from vegetables and lemon pepper flavor. Our new grain is packed with the power of vegetables. Over 90% nutritious vegetables and rice into a tasty grain. Lemon pepper ripe rice, the best dinner edition. Hmm. So we've prepared it, and indeed, you know, it looks like rice. It's rice that's not really made out of rice. It's mm -hmm. made out of lentil flour, chickpea flour, pea fiber, and rice flour. So there's a little bit of rice in the rice. Tiny bit of rice, yeah. So it's crazy. So I remembered the theme was supposed to be like new takes on old favorites. Something so like that. Was, or inventive takes. There we yeah, go. There we go. Rice that's not rice. It smells really good. Hmm. Mm, wow, what's that flavor you think? It's a it's the lemon pepper flavor. Mm. I definitely taste it. It's very zingy. Yeah, I like to eat rice and beans together, so it. they just made it in one food here for it's you. It's pretty wild. Here they're comparing um, right rice with white rice, mm. and um, we have ten grams versus four grams, so two oh, and a half wow. times more protein. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. It's got five grams of fiber versus zero grams. Can't mm. imagine there's none in white mm, rice. Nine, right? And. Um, and um, actually, and since there's a little more protein, a bit more protein, there's a little fewer carbohydrates. Uh, if that's something that you do, we don't. We like all fat, vegan macronutrients. Mm. This is great. Yeah, we're definitely gonna chomp all this down after we're done filming here. Yeah, I guess we should stop for a sec, huh? And move on to another I guess so. item. Ah, <laughs> not a mukbang of. Right, rice. Oh. Like there's another prepared food, babe. There's a lot of prepared. This one's less about snacks and more about food. Doesn't it wow. seem like. What's this one? It is called 
Purpo <laughs> by the by, 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 I can't say Beviva it. Beviva Foods Purpo all in one cereal cup. Sweet and fruity start to the day. No plant milk needed. Whoa. So let's say we can eat it right out of this box here? No way. It's dry. It needs water probably. Okay, well, we'll we could maybe do Dairy that. Dairy-free, gluten-free, soy-free, no artificial ingredients. Let me see what they're suggesting here. It says it has like prebiotics. Let's see. Um... Oh, fill with cold water. Yeah. Okay, so... Is it like an overnight? No. Um, just stir the water, watch it turn purple, and top with... Oh, shoot. Granola. We have water right here, but we don't have a spoon. Well, so I opened this up, and it's just so trippy. I had to share it with you. Now, I think I finally <laughs> get what's going on. So, this is... This is... It says granola. This is a cereal pack. And this is an oat milk pack. So, that's why they say you didn't need any plant-based milk, because we're going to be making this from a dried powder and... They include this trippy little foldable spoon. foldable spoon in here. Wow. So I guess they're thinking like you would bring this with you to school or work or wherever you are on the go. Yeah, on the go food. I've never seen dried oat milk. This is so trippy. Oh my God, it's purple, you guys. Whoa, you see the purple there, huh? Trippy. <laughs> and I brought some water. I think the purple color is really coming out now. Whoa. <laughs> this is one of the weirder things I've seen in a green cup box. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've seen a lot of stuff. We have. Okay, hold the bowl for okay. me. I'll, I'll open up the cereal. This weird cereal kit. Wow, okay, there's more purple stuff going on. That's... Wow, very purple theme. Be Whoa, like look this. how cute. <laughs> if I put enough water, they're going to be like, they're doing it all. <laughs> we might be, and so we apologize. Oh my god. It looks tasty enough. Looks like you're getting enough coating on it. I had it like a super thick paste, I think, instead of a thin milk. Oh, this uh, is literally so strange. That looks more milky now. Mm. Yeah, okay. I'm good. All right, let's try this out. Mm, it reminds me of some cereal from when I was a kid, like mm. pebbles. Oh, how fun. But it's not that sweet. Oh. It's like really hippie. Camping. I know. Take this, this be camping. Crazy camping. You could eat like 10 of those, though. Mm. Yeah, it's good. It's actually pretty good. I like it. Mm hmm. Breakfast at night. I know. That's your favorite. You love cereal at night. Mm. So it's, it's purple sweet potato in both the oat milk and in the cereal. Plus, the delicious fruit is um, sultanas, which are like golden raisins, which are my favorite kind of raisins, mm. cranberries, and papaya. I thought I tasted a little coconut, too. Shredded coconut. So this is not your grandfather's cereal. Mm. <laughs> oh, my God. This package is the cutest. It's Julie's California Superfruit Organic Majul Dates. Majulies. Pitted Date Snack Pack. That is adorable. And it oh says you can God. eat it straight from the box yeah. or, or add to your favorite sweets and salties. Sweets and salties? Yeah. Well, yeah, I have like, I have like taken dates and stuff them with a nut butter and then dip them in chocolate. Hmm. I like dates as they are, but um, I know that Tracy, Tracy the Vegan likes to put them in her uh, oatmeal. One of the things we reviewed earlier. Yeah. I didn't know what they were talking about. Right here. Right here. Yeah, perfectly paired with Julie's dates for overnight oats. Oh, okay. So, I mean, we need to kind of try a date now. Yeah, we can't wait overnight. Yeah. So, let's break out the oh date. Oh, my God. Look at them. If you get the box, you can try the overnight oats and let us know in the comments down below how well that worked out. Well, that's a medjool date. Yeah. Big Smells honking good. date. We haven't had a date in a while. Ooh. We just see way too many dates. We were like date addicts. Mm -hmm. mm. Now I mostly use dates. Mm. I mostly use dates in my pie crusts. And I think also my carrot cakes. And I like to put little pieces of date in my salad. Wow. That's Pretty good. good. That's a good date. My jewelry. All right. Oh, there's only one. I think there's only one more thing, babe. It looks like it's just one tea bag from Miracle Tree. Super caffeinated moringa infusion with cherry chamomile. A cherry tea. Wow. It's a super caffeinated. Super though. infusion cherry tea. Abundantly aromatic and super caffeinated morning tea. Oh yeah, tea. this is what I was smelling. I thought you it was thought makeup. It's, it's this. I totally thought it was. Oh something my god. Yeah, wow. that's wow. I put hair on my a chest. I know. Super <laughs> just strong. Smell it. <laughs> cherry chamomile. Wow, that is strong. I totally thought it was a beauty product. Yeah, it's like. Cherry was something more like musky or something. I guess Earthy. it's the, cam the chamomile. It must be, yeah. Huh? And whatever. And I'm the moringa. I don't really know what moringa smells like. 
If you know, let us know. <laughs> Speaking of caffeine. Uh oh. Is it too late for this? I don't know. Rise Brewing Company. Yikes. Mixed assortment of dark mocha or oat latte. So which one you got? I got there? oat milk latte. Nitro cold brew coffee. Dairy free. Creamy, sweet, and refreshingly smooth. Uh, you know, I've had these and they're super good. I want it, but it's nighttime. It is night for us right now. Oh, I'll have it first thing in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to drink it so bad. There was like a lot of good breakfast things in here, huh? Yeah. Is it time for us to go and deliberate? Yes, it's time to deliberate. Because right. we're going to pick a fave. Two faves. Almost forgot the Zollipop. Zolly candy zolly pops, healthy lollipops that taste great and are good for your smile. They're healthy lollipops. You know, I re I realize why it's a zolly pop. It has xylitol. Xylitol. Okay. I don't know much about xylitol. Just says so it helps. I don't. Yeah, you guys know it's. I guess it's some kind of thing that's sugar-like, but doesn't have mm -hmm. the properties of sugar as far as how it decays in our mouth. Mm. Tooth decay. I mean. All right. Cool. Hmm. It's not that sweet. Mm hmm That's, I guess, the, the selling point, huh? Not as sugar-packed. Mm -hmm. It kind of seems more like, uh, um, do you want it? this I just fit in my that, mouth? That might be too much. Huh? We share everything. But, yeah, maybe we'll just kind of draw the line on the lollipop. What do you guys think? Should I have, have it or not? There's two lollipops. <laughs> I'll just let you do this one. That's cool. You know, I realize I'm not going to be able to deliberate properly unless I have some of this. Oh, so. that's your justification to open up the I really caffeine? want it. All right. <laughs> After having the oatmeal, I like really, whoa! Did you guys hear that? Oh, my gosh. Feel your mind. That's what it mm. says. Yeah, what is it? Feel, you're going to feel, feel your mind. Your huh? mind. I'm not going to drink the whole thing. I hope not, or else no. you're not going to sleep tonight. I'm going to get some sleep by myself. Mmm. Wow. Okay, I really taste the oat milk. All right, I'll have it the tiniest mm. sip just so I know what the flavor is. The coffee flavor is super mild. It just tastes like oat milk. Yeah. Right? It's probably enough for you for, what, post 9 p.m. here? <laughs> I think just to be prudent. We'll have one last little, just a little, I, I just got a little flavor sip, you know? Mm. That was more than a flavor sip. <laughs> I mean, actually, you are supposed to serve a cold, and it'll be better when it's really I could cold. imagine it'd be better cold, yeah. It is better cold, or like over some ice. All right. That's it. Hope I'll, I'll let you guys know later if Angie went to bed tonight. How about you go first? All right. After much serious and thoughtful deliberation, I've come to the conclusion that the Unisoy vegan jerky. What a not a surprise. <laughs> yeah. I'm having a tough time, honestly, between the Cookie Plus and the Go Macro. The Go Macro has got like a is more of a like a rich flavor, very chocolatey and peanut buttery. Whereas this really is like a classic, mm -hmm. delicious chocolate chip cookie. Old school. I guess the mm. hence the theme of this box. Right there. So wait, so I wonder what's different about this than, than from like a regular cookie. How is it healthier? Because um, we got like raw sugar, faba bean protein, and oh. things like that. Faba yeah. bean? Okay, I'm going with the cookie. Okay. By a very slim margin. <laughs> so I'm curious what your favorite in this box is. If you've already gotten one this month, if you haven't, I think there's still time because we've actually done this video on time-ish. Yeah, odds are <laughs> we'll get this out in the same month that it, the box came out for it would be a first. Shocking! <laughs> so if you'd like to pick up the April box or even if you want to pick up the May box, we've got a code for you to save five bucks. Happy Healthy, healthy vegan. vegan. Yes, when you check out at vegancuts.com, we'll have uh, this in the show notes down below. Oh, it's five bucks off any subscription. So it could be the snack box, the beauty box, which I may give you a peek at, or the uh, four times a year makeup box. Five bucks off any subscription. And then we have some other deals from Vegan Cuts as well. I'll just have them all down in the show notes below. Yeah. So we want to thank Vegan Cuts for continuing to send us these super fun boxes. And thank Vegan check Cuts out with you guys. for our dinner tonight here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, thanks for watching. Leave your comments down below. Again, let us know if you've had any of these items or if you'd like to try any of these items. If you have any questions for us, we'll try to answer mm -hmm. them to the best of our knowledge. Um, yeah, hit like and subscribe to our channel if you're not already. Hit that notification bell too to get notified for new videos, live streams, community tab posts, the whole nine yards. So yeah. guess that's it, huh? 
Yeah, I guess one re- I oh. want to tell you to be sure to hit the notification button because we've been doing live premieres of pretty much every single video we like put this out. This one, yeah. New videos come out with us in the chat stream there, yes. sitting there chatting with you, you guys. Chat with both of us and other people in our community, so that's super fun. In case you wonder what if you got the live premiere notifications, what that means. We're yeah. there. It's a new video coming out, and we're there with you. Woohoo! Mm-hmm. Yeah. So until next time. Let's what? Keep it carved, baby. Oh, keep, keep it, it carved. carved. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let me just quickly show you what is in the beauty box for this month. Um, there is a Porfix strip. I guess it's to clean blackheads on your nose. A vitamin E fragrance-free therapeutic, ooh, shea body lotion, ooh, by Derma E. I am very excited. The other Derma E products that I've gotten from Vegan Cuts were all really good. And then a full size too, that's so nice, not a sample. This cocoa and coconut superfood reviving hydrating mask. That sounds potentially really good as well. In sync with nature. Some sort of a serum. You guys could probably even read this better than I. And finally, this looks good. Ooh, crazy rumors. French vanilla lip balm. That sounds amazing. Yes. So that is what is in this month's beauty box. <laughs> you look crazy. All right.